Swiggity Swag, what's in the bag? Jay here, and yo, it feels really good to be able to say that again. Welcome back, welcome back. I guess it's more so a welcome back for me because I've been gone for two weeks. So this video is basically explaining what happened in the two weeks or what happened uh, while I was gone or whatever and why I was gone for two weeks. So most of you guys already know what happened if you guys pay attention to my community posts or my Twitter posts and stuff like that. You guys know what happened, but I know some of you guys don't know what happened just from like a comment that I got yesterday. Uh, Cause someone was asking me, you know, where are your Gala Laxi summons in Dragalia? Jay, I've been waiting forever. And I was like, yo, I, I made a community post about why I wasn't uploading or whatever. Anyways, the reason why I was gone for two weeks is because my computer died. <laughs> it died at literally the worst possible moment, dude. Because BBS anniversary was, well, I'm not going to say it was a hype anniversary, but, you know, obviously the anniversary of a gacha game is really big, especially when it comes to content creation, because that gets, you know, a lot of people into the game. A lot of people start to re-roll and start to play the game and everything. So it was just... A really bad time for my computer to like go down like that so that's you know long story short my computer died but the long story is that mid July uh, I remember the day it was the 17th of July um, I get up I get on my computer everything's working fine right I'm like cool awesome so check my socials and I turned off my computer at least I'm pretty sure I turned off my computer because I always shut down my computer before I go somewhere so I shut down my computer get dressed and I go run errands for a few hours. I come back and my computer monitor, my main monitor is turning off, which doesn't make any sense. Cause I was like, wait, I know I shut down my computer. So I'm like, okay, maybe there was like a rolling blackout or something like that. Cause we have those over here. So I try to turn my computer and it's not turning on. I'm like, okay. So I turn off the power supply, turn it back on, try to turn on computer, I see lights, it's starting to boot, and then it shuts down. Like, I don't even get into Windows. I don't even I don't even get to see the freaking motherboard screen. I don't even get to post. Like, I, I don't I don't get past post because it just shuts down. And then it tries to boot up again and shut down again and do it. It keeps trying to do that by itself. So I'm like, okay, something is very, very wrong here. So I'm thinking, well, maybe it's a rolling blackout? I, I don't know. Maybe this was just just really bad, really bad or a surge or something. But I'm like, I'm plug into a brand new surge protector. And then I go to the kitchen to check the microwave and to check the uh, coffee maker because they have clocks on them. Normally when they roll a blackout, the clocks reset. The clocks were not reset. So I was like, I don't know what the hell happened while well, I was gone for a few hours, but okay, maybe it's the power supply. So I switched out the power supply because I had another one laying around from like four years ago when I was gonna use it, but never used it. And I was already dreading the process of switching out the power supply because you got to unplug all the cables and replug them all up and it, it, it's it, it's a hassle. But I was like, I need my computer. So I did all that, tried to turn on the computer and guess what? Nothing happened. It still did, did the same exact thing. Boot up, shut down, boot up, shut down. So I'm like, well, if it's not a power supply issue, and I'm pretty sure it's, it's definitely not an operating uh, system issue, obviously, because like I'm well, I'm here, right? Like I'm, you know, I'm here right now. So I was like, well, maybe it's either a CPU issue or a motherboard issue, probably a motherboard issue. And if it's, or maybe, maybe the power supply went bad and took the motherboard with it or something like that. I don't know, but either way, it seemed like it was an issue that was not going to be easily fixed. Uh, you know, I would have to buy a new motherboard and CPU. So I was like, well, if I'm going to buy another motherboard and a CPU, I'm just gonna build a whole new computer because my computer, my old computer was like four years old and I'm not gonna get a four year old processor or a four year old motherboard or a motherboard and processor from four years ago. I'm not gonna do that because I was running, I was running a i7, uh, 6700K, something like that. So like, that's what I was uh, running in the old PC. I'm not gonna get that exact, pro I'm not gonna get that processor. There's just no fucking reason why. It's just, I don't even think I can, can get it. Probably could, but I'm not going to, that's stupid. So. I was like, well, might as well just build a new computer. So I had to sit down and like, I had to like wrap my head around what just happened, right? Cause like everything happened at the worst possible time because I had one more Dokkan video that I uploaded yesterday. Uh, I had one more Dokkan video to upload from the, uh, from the Gogeta summons. 
and then BBS anniversary. Like I missed the in well, I didn't miss the entire entire anniversary, but like, cause like, but I'm on like the tail end of it. I came back at pretty much the end <laughs> of the anniversary, and I'm just like, dude, this sucks. Like this absolutely sucks. It's like it sucks that every like my computer died during bbs anniversary like literally at the start you know i wanted to react to ichigo i wanted to react to byakuya uh, i wanted to show you guys my summons i mean my banner summons were trash but my ticket summons bro the ticket like the bbs ticket i got super mad lucky and i somehow pulled the new ichigo off of bbs tickets i showed a picture uh in the community tab i don't know how i did it it was like 5 30 in the morning i summoned and i, I used my bb tech uh, bbs tickets and i was like Okay, because he was because the Ichigo is what I want him because like that's the closest we're gonna ever get to full bring Ichigo I'm pretty sure at, at this point right because they just for whatever reason they just don't want to give us full bring Ichigo not like full bring Soul Reaver Ichigo but like the full bring Ichigo that we see for five minutes before uh, Kugo takes his power right that Ichigo I wanted the Ichigo for a long time so I guess now we got full Getsu so whatever it's fine right it's cool I got him. He's really good. He's he's dumb. That's what he is. He is stupid dumb. And then that was your blood war round ten with Uryu, Jugo, and Basby. You can't you didn't, uh, didn't get to see my summons on that, but I pulled three Uryu. I showed uh, a picture of that in the community tab as well. But just missing anniversary is really oh it sucks, bro. It sucks. That's like the one time that you can you know get people into the game. The one time. Um, you know to really grow because it's anniversary everybody's gonna be you know looking at summons and videos and showcases and all this stuff so i'm just like i really lost my computer at the worst possible time so i so i literally had to sit down and just wrap my head around what was going on and just what happened in general so then i had to hit up my uh well spite hit me up actually and uh he was uh asking me what was going on with my computer and everything and um you know, he talked to one of his people, and his uh, one of his people said it pro it's probably the motherboard, so he might as well just get a new computer at that point. So I was like, yeah, I'm probably just going to uh, invest in a new computer, you know, and blah, 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 blah. And then I hit up my friend House, uh, who loves to, he loves to uh, help people pick out parts for PCs and stuff. So I'm going to leave, like, my build in the description and in the comments, I'm going to have it pinned. Uh, I'll, I'll just have the PC part picker list because it's just, I still have the list. Of everything so if you guys want to see what i'm running then you know there you go um but yeah i had to wait for all the parts to come in which that was a hassle in itself what and what really sucks is that i bought a new microphone i'm not using it right now because i need a mixer but like i bought a new microphone and i was like awesome okay i just got to get the mixer and we'll be good but it's on back order but i'm gonna get it and be good then computer dies and i'm like well dang i'm just i just got to get a whole new freaking setup at this point so it, it sucked, but, um, but yeah, I ordered all the parts and I sent, I had to wait, you know, I had to wait for everything to come in the mail. Well, I didn't have to buy all the parts online. Cause I mean, I work, I work at Best Buy, if you guys didn't already know. So I got some of the parts from the store and then the rest of them had to order online. And the last thing that came in was the graphics card. But once that came in, I had to go out in the rain to get that sucker. But I, I did, I did it. Cause I wanted my freaking computer, but got my uh, graphics card, put the computer together. I was I was so happy that like I was able to actually build it and put it together myself because I haven't built a computer in like 10 years, whatever, right? And the last time I built a computer, it was for class. And so it was like a really garbage computer, you know? But, and it was like a lot of trouble trying to like get stuff in the computer. More so the motherboard didn't want to cooperate with me, but I finally got in there. So, you know, that was good. Um, the hot one of the hard drives is like kind of sitting awkwardly, but I'm not gonna be moving my computer a lot anyway, so it's fine. Um, but yeah, either way, I had to put the computer together, put it together, booted it up, everything was working, and I was like, well, at this point, let me just rearrange my entire setup. So I, I literally took down my entire setup and everything, cords all over the bed, and it, it was just man it was bad <laughs> it was bad it was bad it was really bad but that's why you see a new camera angle that's why you see all this well it's not really well some of it's junk some of it's junk some of it's not i'm gonna probably clean this up over here uh, at some point yeah i see the microphone coming from way over here now 
Uh, I was kind of sort of just prepping for the new microphone. So that's why the microphone's over here instead of like on my left, it's on my right. Uh, well, it looks, I don't know how I'm gonna have this video like looking, but it's, it's on my right side. Like this, this is my right. So whatever, anyways, I'm back. Uh, I'm back. I'm not sure how much else I'm gonna be uploading uh about bbs as far as the fifth anniversary goes i'll probably talk about anniversary because personally i think this anniversary was kind of doo-doo uh yeah i think it, it was kind of it was kind of doo-doo the fact that the step up banner was not like the fact that all the other step up banners we got this year were better than the anniversary step ups makes no sense like it makes absolutely no sense to me like why is that the anniversary step up banner only has one guarantee five star step that like step what six yeah it was like step six that was the guarantee five so that makes no sense like wh why would i mean obviously sure the first multi is free that's cool but you have to build up your rate though you know it's not like you know the five the step five step ten banners where it's a it's a flat six percent rate through all the steps but you have a discounted first uh and second multi like i would have i would have taken that kind of banner over what we got which was like yeah sure free multi 150 200 250 250, 250. like I, I don't i didn't really care for all that honestly i would have just took the flat step or the flat rate of six percent and then just go right because eight percent means nothing i, I don't know about y'all but eight percent in bbs means absolutely nothing i don't know how i mean because like i did what like four step seven multis on a thousand billboard banner and it was all gold showers i was like this game sucks <laughs> um but yeah i pulled three uduyu i didn't really want uduyu but he's actually really cool though especially with the ailment reversal he's really cool uh i would have been happy with basby too but i really wanted jugo i really wanted jugo because he is breaking pvp or rather brave battles let me call it that he is breaking brave battles okay and that's that, I, li I like break battles like I really do but holy crap fighting him is really scary but you literally have to outlive him right you have to outlive the 10 second invincibility which 10 seconds in brave battles is a long time like that is long like that's that's a whole match that's a whole match and some matches don't even last that long so like it's crazy I want him so I'm gonna summon on his individual um, and then we got this new uh, Senkaimon Ichigo as well uh, that boosts humans. So now I'm thinking, well, whoa, whoa, if we're getting this Ichigo, then next camp for our world could be Aura. And I will definitely summon for Aura. And if it's Aura, Tsukushima, and like Kugo, then I already know Kugo's gonna show up, but it's fine. It's fine. It's cool. It's cool. Anyways, I just wanted to update you guys with what well, what happened. Like I said, my computer died. If you guys want to know my specific build, it will be in the video description and uh, pinned in the comments below. Um, yeah, I'm just happy to be back. I'm just happy to be back. Uh, I will be doing the fifth anniversary tower today on Twitch, so definitely check out my Twitch channel. It's always linked in the video description below. Um, you can leave a like if you want to, you don't really need to. This is just an update video, just to let you guys know that I'm back, back to uploading, back to making content. I'm happy to be back. I was actually getting used to not having a computer, but sometimes going home, like coming home was just kind of like bummy, dude, because like I come home and it'd be like, dang, I have no computer. So now I just get in bed, watch TV, and farm gotchas until it's time to go to sleep <laughs> like that's really all i could do you know i didn't really want to play any other games because it's like you know if i want to play my switch normally i don't play my switch undocked especially for playing smash i don't play undocked so then it's like sitting at my sitting at my desk it's like it was just sad so i didn't really want to do that but yeah i'm back thank y'all for the support and uh yeah i'll see you guys later peace